virus. But you have my word, and we will manage the hell out of this operation. For his first 100 days in office, Biden setting the goal of administering 100 million vaccine doses. His administration touting their plan as ambitious, but the previous administration was already on par with that pace, recently hitting the milestone of vaccinating a million people per day. And yet some say that might not be enough. Heartbreaking scenes like this in Florida, people lining up for hours, eagerly awaiting a shot, only to be turned away. Local leaders across the country saying they've run out of doses, now left to wait for more supply. The state of Michigan had a shortfall, about 50,000 vaccines. In Madera County, California, more than 800 people had their appointments canceled until the next shipment arrives. New York City temporarily closing some of its vaccine hubs and rescheduling thousands of appointments for next week. We've had to tell 23,000 New Yorkers who had an appointment this week that they will not be able to get that appointment for lack of supply. New York, one of many states frustrated by the distribution process. As the hardest hit state, and we went from getting 300,000 doses a, a week, which is actually paltry compared to the population we need to serve, down to 250,000. States have been playing a guessing game, only learning week to week how much more vaccine they'll get. They were getting informed they'll get this amount of vaccine next week, but that doesn't really help them project out how many total first doses they can give or how many second doses they need to have available. The Trump administration set a goal to deliver 20 million vaccines to Americans by the end of 2020, but ultimately fell short. Of the 37 million doses distributed so far, roughly 17 million have been administered, according to the CDC. Biden proposing $20 billion to develop a national vaccination program, setting up mobile units in hard-to-reach communities, and large vaccination centers in areas with bigger populations. In Alabama, Jim and Sandy Mariner showed up to receive their shots, only to find out no one was there to administer them after a scheduling mix-up. We waited a long time for this. It's finally here. And then when the opportunity comes, somebody dropped the ball. And we're still waiting to get our shots. Like many Americans, Jim is scared to wait any longer to get vaccinated. I have a dire need for the vaccine. If I catch this thing, I'm gone. Yes, so I'm going to have you pull down in the lane one right here, please. Earlier this week, here in hard-hit Los Angeles County, we visited a mega site that's vaccinating thousands a day. With this shot, 65-year-old Kathleen Dragovich is one step closer to seeing her 91-year-old mother, who she hasn't seen in over a year. Well, email you in a couple of days to schedule the second shot. Kathleen registered for an appointment online, then was in and out of the drive-thru site in an hour. 